Hello everyone, Basif here, and welcome back to Senua's Sacrifice. Uh, I gotta say something that's kind of upsetting here. Uh, yesterday I was messing with some of my settings in Twitch, and uh, somewhere along the line I unchecked the archive uh, videos checkbox, so all my playthrough yesterday is gone. Uh, I can't upload it to YouTube, it's not even on Twitch anymore, I opened it help ticket see if they maybe store it on the servers even if you don't archive it but I do not have high hopes for it super bummer I it was one of my best playthroughs considering I had no issues with my upstream uh, the game loaded well I, th I thought my commentary was actually better than it has been I had no issues with microphone nothing it was beautiful um, and I did figure out the issue with my headphones yesterday so hopefully that comes through today as well uh, but I did beat the second boss uh, he is down he was significantly harder uh, than the first boss by a very significant margin I didn't die at all yesterday though um, although I got very close on the boss so uh, I was gonna originally see if I could load up a previous save but it looks like there is no save system that you can load up on at least not in the game interface you might be able to do it through some logs or something but anyway that's the update I uh, hope you will stick around with me through this time even though there's a little bit stuff missing uh, let's move forward all right oh I also wanted to mention like uh, the illusion stuff of the last boss we had to look through the little areas so awesome that was so well done I like puzzles like that and it just it looks neat when you like sidestep it and you can see it change you know like if this was a thing you'd be like Whoop, oh no there's a bridge there kind of thing that was awesome but I am very much enjoying this game so far I like when you come out of beating a boss how everything turns green and beautiful again also what we discovered yesterday is even in victory there's defeat so you'll notice that yes I didn't die yesterday, but my scar or my rot has grown. Um, that's what they said in uh, one of the cutscenes. Spoilers, by the way. She was younger. She would lay in the grass and stare at the clouds. And then she saw them. Elusive. Shifting faces. After a while, she could see the faces everywhere. In the trees. Mountains, caves. Man, I, I really struggle with the trying to do a commentary while walking around and stuff comes in. Uh, I don't even remember what I was saying. Oh well. But that commentary, or that narrative was right there was great because if you notice, she actually looked up at the clouds. Nice touch there. That oh, This game is so good. I'm enjoying it. And, uh, and like the writing is good, the narration is amazing. Another game that I love, is, uh, the writing is superb, and just the voice actor just is icing on the cake. Is uh, Darkest Dungeon. That game can be brutal, but man, I love the writing in it. And Wayne June mm, gets me happy. Come on, go under there. Go under there. There you go. I actually don't know where I'm going anymore. What the? Go away. I think I go back, because that's what happened with Cert. You had to go back to where you came from. Oh yeah, because I had to kill those two guys to unlock the new area. Am I being chased by darkness? But uh, if any of you guys have uh, picked up this game, I'd like to know your thoughts and comments are on this as well. Can you see the faces too? They're there. If you look for them. That's going to be a clue to actually look for faces in the sky. I've learned to pay more attention to the voices and narrative. Whoa. 
That's her mom, or is she just calling it like Mother Senua, Earth? you have the sight, just like I do. Once you can see into the underworld, the underworld and all the souls within it will see you. Don't be afraid when they speak to you. I will always be here to guide you. Did you see her? That was her mother, Galena. She was a priestess, a healer. She taught Senua to see the weave that binds the world together. And it was beautiful. It was a time before the darkness. But when it did come, it first came for her mother. Senua still sees her face from time to time, hidden in the world. Like she's still watching over. She misses her so much. I'm trying to think of what I can cover from my lost video yesterday. We were exposed to some new monsters. They look the same. They're combat styles are getting a, a bit more aggressive uh, what else some of them had a uh, new weapons a couple of new moves came from some of them found out the crazy uh, you can use your focus ability while fighting in combat not just for bosses I haven't quite figured out how that triggers or what but you be to get a big glowy thing to your left of the screen whoa Scared me. You may cross the bridge over the river of knives to Helheim. Alright. And uh when it starts glowing purple or whatever, that's when you use it, it like slows time or something and you can really wail on stuff. Why is she waiting? Open she has the gate. To open no, the gate. Don't. No, it's dangerous. It's dangerous. Don't open the gate. Don't. Oh, just all dark. That's lovely. Don't anything jump out at me. So dark, it's dark, the dark. Only the dead may cross. Only the dead may cross into hell. She's missing her face paint. Here but me. Not you. Did you think that I would let you go? That you lost me back in the wilds? I will never let you go. You can't get rid of me. I am your shadow. And I will be watching when you draw your last dying gasp. I'm not ready to die. You will be when you see what they did to your dear beloved. You cannot pray. They can break you. 
but not your promise. Even death won't keep you apart. Through his darkness you will find him. In your sword still beats a heart. You fought for love unspoiled. By your darkness within. You fought for your dreams. Now there's no way to win. In the head of his corpse lies the seat of his soul. So you must carry his vessel to bring him back home. Sword still beats a heart. Did you guys catch the typo in the subtitles? The darkness touched you. Everyone could see it in the hollows of your eyes. A gaze averted. From life. You ran from it but brought it nearer. Led it to him. An endless suffering worse than death. Why do I look all creepy now? Surrender. Abandoned to find peace with the gods. No. The darkness won't allow it. So you will walk into the lair of the beast. Look it in the eye, and you will go to war. This is your mission. This is your quest. There is nothing else left. Alrighty. I thought, uh, I thought Dillian was, they did a bloody eagle to him. Is that what it's called? The Vikings pulled out your ribs from your back and Splayed them out like wings of an eagle. Brutal way to die. Come at me. Come at me. I'm scared of you. Ooh. Here it is. That thing. close enough. It's been great this whole time, but significantly cooler. Get it, sunshine! I bet I can't kick him off, can I? Nope. Kick him in the face! Yeah. Get some. She's so cool. I think I made a comment, the video that got lost, or my first place, I don't remember, but the game reminds me of uh, Fury Road. 
which is a fantastic movie. I was a war boy for Halloween. Every the year it came out. Into darkness. Brings out another chance. Ooh! Jesus scared the crap out of me. Dodge! No. Is that cert? Cause I killed that bastard. No, it's not. Get up, get up, get up! Ooh! Who the hell are you? Chump wow, I'm really slow. Can I do a backstab in here? That'd be great. Go Dark Souls on him. Ooh! That could have not been well. Ooh! Ooh, that was a big sweep. Get it! You're just a big... Oh, that's not fair. He's got sweeping moves that follow. Good to know. Ooh! Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can't block that move. I'm gonna try. This guy just probably have to dodge. Get him. Get him. Switch. Oh, that's how you do it. Oh, that was awesome! Yeah, I saw you. your come at me symbol and I charge your ass. Get him, get him, show him what's what. Nothing. Ooh, remember the name, Senua, the destroyer. It's coming to wreck your souls. Ooh, can't block that. Ooh, can't block that. Yeah, you swing that way. Get it, get it. She's so freaking cool. that you actually put on him. It's pretty dope. Oh, I didn't think he was going to do a second one. Yeah, oh, oh. They, they do uh, big hits that are hard to block. Kick him in the face. Eat this. Satchmo. Get it, get it, get it. Oh. I wonder if that just counts as a shield break when she charges or if it's just the kick. It's nearly over. Finish it. Kick him in the teeth. Yeah. Oh, she's so cool. Senwa is Bay. Bay. That was supposed to be Bay. See? See how much my brain hates that? I couldn't even say it right the first time. Door? Door. Door! More runes. Alright. We've done this before. Fish, Z and X, alright. The journey to Helheim is never a straight one. Each must find their own path. Align yourself to its secrets, and you will find yours. Is that the one that just talked to me? Because... However you come to the gold-covered bridge that leads to Hell, you may find it guarded by a giantess. She will ask your name. She will ask your lineage. She will ask your business. The Northmen tell of the warrior woman, Brynhild, who leapt into fire and rode to hell to join her slain love, Sigurd, and is challenged by the 
giantess. Yeah, Brynhild. Nope. Kind of guessed that that was going to be there. Alright, puzzle area. Can I get... Oh, I can't go down here. I thought this was just water. Alright, we're looking for a fish. An X and a Z, right? Why are you telling me to focus? Nothing over there. Oh man. Is this all I have? Is this small area? Because this is not going to be easy. I mean, you'd think it would be if it's so tiny. Or is there going to be no context? Like it. However what? you come oh. to the gold-covered bridge that leads to hell, you may find it guarded by a giantess. I need she will to... ask your name. She will ask your lineage. She will ask your business. The Northmen tell of the warrior woman Brynhild, who leapt into fire and rode to hell to join her slain love Sigurd, and is challenged by the giantess. Can be like... My business is my own. You know, like, uh. Lord of the Rings. My name's Underhill. Alright, none of these is popping out, but the X is around here somewhere. I'm assuming it has something to do with these planks. Yeah, see the X is showing up more. Does that count? No? What is this? Is this like illusionary stuff? What the? What is that? I don't want. Is that a bug? Don't quite know what's going on with that. I had the X come out somewhere over here, right? Yeah. All right. What can I turn an X into? Or into an X, rather. disappears as soon as I step forward from here. So there's got to be something. Is there like a shadow? Uh. Alright. Getting slightly confused. And this is the only one with the red runes showing up. I didn't see the other areas yet either. That's got to be telling me that that's an illusionary ramp up there, right? Like, is that supposed to be there to tell you, like, later you need to come back? Or is that a bug that's not supposed to be showing that to me yet? I guess we'll find out sooner or later. All right, somehow over here. Oh, maybe I gotta get on the boat and look up. Well, no, cause then I'm outside of the, the red rune zone. Usually doesn't like when I do that. Oh. Oh, it's combining the puzzles now. I gotcha. 
It's kind of annoying that I couldn't do it up there, though. Okay. So look for funky floatingnesses in the air. It means illusion that you can open. Oh, here's the Z's. Okay. Or S's, rather. That looks like a. I can turn it into an X. Or the S right there. Right? Right? Come on. There you go. No, no. That's got to count. No. That has to be it. I bet you that thing drops or something because that would be the spot on spot. Alright. What's yonder? Can I go down here? Didn't see any illusion stuff. There's a ladder here. Ooh, a, a talking stone. Ooh, fish. Oh, it's a fish. No way, it's gotta be all of them. It's all of them, it's gotta be. Cause it turned into all of them. No, no, go down there. Go down there, I, I wanted you to go down there. Go on. There you go. All right. I don't want to go talk to the talking stone. I really like this mechanic of the spreading rot. It adds that feeling of... Oh shit. But it's also kind of awesome. Always gives you that visual reminder of... Don't get your ass kicked so much. Permanent. It's not like you just heal it. I'm glad there isn't persistent health, though. It's always just for that combat. Hella possesses large dwelling places in Helheim. Tall are her walls. High are her gates. The name of her dish is hunger. Her knife is famine. On her threshold, all will stumble. Her bed is called sick bed, and her bed hangings are called flames of a funeral pyre. They say she is easy to recognize, half black and half the color of flesh, and her face menacing and grim. How doesn't that count? There it goes. Alright, this was a cool puzzle. I dig this one. It's all the same thing. So I don't think I could move that thing, so it's just got to be something close to this. There it goes. Okay. Got it. Got it. Can I jump down? Can I jump down? Dang it. Cool. I kind of want to see if they have any weather effects with her hair or something. Have to fight some bows, huh? Just take on a hurricane. Could do that. What was that? 
sound like something flying out of the water. Oh! The gate is opening. Oh! Darkness coming at me? It's coming. That song again. Is it? Is it? Is it? Tell her. Yes. The source of the darkness. It's coming. This is your moment. I'm sorry. I can't watch this. Oh, the narrator leaves? What are you doing? You're showing weakness. You're not a warrior. You're a disgrace. The gods will punish you for this. Pick up the sword. Pick it up. Fight the darkness. Get it. Get it, girl. You got this. Get up. Get up. It's just a god. Get up and fight. Gods can be killed. Ooh, that thing is creepy looking. Alright, I'll give it to her. She's badass. Just gonna go fight a god. Hell is reaching deep inside of her. Stormy seas and lost souls. She's dreamt of this before. They say dreams are visions of our memories, thoughts, and fears, as seen by our inner eye. But what if each one of us is always dreaming, even when awake, and we only see what our inner eye creates for us? Is this what hell is? world shaped by Senua's nightmares. Maybe that's why people feared seeing the world through her eyes. Because if you believe that Senua's reality is twisted, you must accept that yours might be too. You fail the gods. You're pathetic. Rotten. Cursed. What were you thinking? Did you really think you could win? How stupid can you be? Everyone hates her. She's cursed. Look at you. A warrior. Worthless. Weak. Pathetic. Go on. Feel sorry for yourself. Because there is no one left to do that for you. Was that supposed to be synced? Take it. It's just a bummer, but it's not. Coward to fight and end the suffering. Break the thing. Broken and lost. <laughs> just Do like it. your sword. Come on. There. <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, slightly confused. Go on. When you give everything and face that which torments you, only to find that it is worse than you could have imagined. Why go on? Is it really so weak to ask this? Or are we just so afraid of the honest answer that we do not dare pose the question? Sometimes the answer lies in a memory. Feeling a song. It's not real. It's true. It has to be real. Listen to me. She can't you give up. Did it? Did it? It's not like this. It's not real. It's real. It's a trick. Don't trust it. Maybe you're already dead. Who are you?
Okay. I do something to my stomach, or is that where I got hit? Uh, other question is, was that deep voice talking in the mirror, was that supposed to be synced with the, her lips moving? Because that would have made the effect that much more crazy. I, I think maybe it was just a bug. Which was kind of a bummer, because it threw me off. Would you do your stomach? That, is that where she punched you? Did my rot grow again? Is there... Man, that, that's brutal if there's like... She's gonna say, uh... It's kinda brutal if there's a force number of deaths that you have to take that increase the rot and if you just happen to die enough times in your own play if you can't keep playing on it that's that's brutal kind of not fair there it is you're right it's dead good i don't know what you're looking at before he disappears come who are you looking at Okay, so when I run, she falls over. You can do it. You can do it. You're tough. You got this, girl. I kind of don't want to talk over to this. Before she first met him, she was not in a good place. Just a teenager, but not like the others. Barely functioning, she rarely left the house. Her father, Zinbel, made sure of that. Only occasionally did she venture out on her own, collecting firewood and herbs, errands out in the Orkney Plains. That was her world. Like this one. Barren and lonely. Looks like uh, her stomach wound is healing. Or maybe it's because she had like, got hit there really hard and it's just not hurting as much anymore. Look for faces. I'm having difficulty talking over this because I feel like it, it ruins the mood like we, we need to be feeling for her right now you know, she, she's struggling and fighting with her own demons here and then she has literal gods trying to ruin her life all right there's quite a few ways here seems I can go so got to explore the other avenues Looks like nothing. Unless there's a face on something. Oh. A lot of messed up boats here though. This could be just some foreshadowing. light up there. Alright, checking out the you cave. Can see it. 
face. Senua, there will be times that you will feel alone and exhausted. Like a strange little fish swimming against the tides of the big ocean. But have the faith to let go and let the tide carry you away. Because the whole ocean is your home. And it does not ask you to swim against it. Screw that noise, only dead fish swim with the current. I kinda feel bad making her run. But we're going to get Dillian. Push through. You got it. Music's picking up. Like it. There he was. The lone figure of a boy. He saw a play under the shade of a tree. She remembers the first time she saw him. Her young eyes, he moved as if dancing, and the world danced with him. The gloom lifted, and for the first time in years, she felt a ray of hope. Man, I did. saying before chanter guy interrupted me I love the writing it's so good is that a hole I can walk in it's like a sewer. Sewer drain? Can't go in it. Alright. Well, you don't want to with a, a stomach wound if it's open. His father's hall was built around a great tree, and one day, Odin comes and thrusts a sword into the tree, a gift to whomever can release it. Many try, but the sword only comes out at Sigmund's touch. Excalibur. His brother-in-law, King Sigir, wants it, but Sigmund refuses him, so King Sigir plots revenge. He invites Sigmund and his brothers to a feast, but when they arrive, they are met with an army, not a warm welcome. King Sigir captures Sigmund and his brothers, steals his coveted sword, and readies them for execution. Very similar to Excalibur. That's actually one interesting thing about mythology is a lot of stories are actually transcribed to other mythos. Kind of interesting. Like some guys, like I liked that story that this culture told them, and I translate it into our culture with slightly different context or people. Probably should have activated this first, because then if something was out there, I wouldn't have wasted this time. first.
tree with serpents holding on to people. Alright. Maybe we can't do this part yet. I also haven't figured out uh, the death mechanic yet. Like, uh, the second boss jacked me up really good on more than a few occasions, and I could have swore I was gonna die. And somehow I kept being able to get back up. So I don't know what the mechanic all is. Like, if you get hit when you're down, maybe that's when you're dead. If you get do knocked down too many times, you're dead. I don't know yet. Kinda don't wanna figure it out, cause. Rots of spreads, and that's not good. <laughs> kind of want to see if there's going to be a cloud that shows up in the sky. That'd be cool. I may have already missed it though, because uh. narrator brought it up. What we got over here? Oh. This is the other side of the boat. This game hasn't put in any, like, hidden secrets and stuff really anywhere. So I don't know if it's actually worthwhile to just keep exploring like that. Hey! Okay, I lie. Death for Sigmund and his brother seems certain. But the king's wife is Sigmund's sister, and she begs for mercy, and implores the king to chain them up instead. He agrees. Not for mercy, though, but because he plans an even more cruel thing to do. Chained to a tree in the forest that night, a she-wolf comes and devours one of Sigmund's brothers. She returns, ravenous, night after night, until only Sigmund is left. The next day, Sigmund's sister sends a servant with honey to smear on Sigmund's face. But to what end? Well, that night, when the she-wolf appears again, you'll never guess what happens. She-wolf is like, I like honey, and becomes a domesticated wolf. That'd be awesome if that's all it took. It's like, hey grizzly bear, you want some honey? Oh, now we're pals. I have a grizzly bear mount. Hooray. I feel like I forgot a direction, but I'm not gonna go back. Damn. Watching from afar, she mimicked him, perfecting her own secret dance. Wishing those fleeting moments of light would stretch out to last forever. As the she wolf licks the sweet honey from Sigmund's face, he bites the wolf's tongue. The she wolf pulls away, but Sigmund holds on. The chains break. Is free. After his escape, Sigmund lives like us, hidden in the forest. His enemy, King Sigir, believing him dead, as his sister plots revenge. And for vengeance to succeed, even the great Sigmund needs help. So she sends her sons to him. But their blood is weak and corrupted, and they're put to death by Sigmund. So his sister hatches a new one that is cold of heart and pure of blood. Man, that would be a uh, Mickey Torn, wouldn't it? I'm gonna save my brother from my husband killing him. So plot revenge. Send my sons out to help my brother, and then he kills them. Like, maybe I don't want to help them. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Blue flashing light. Whoa. Oh look, she's happy. The world and bliss. If only she could do the same. See the world through eyes anew. And dance with it. Just like he does. I'm actually feeling very happy right now. Cause she's actually is sharing a moment of happiness right now. Look at this. Let's just revel in this for a moment. Just let her have this moment of happiness. controlling it anymore. What's your name? Senua. I haven't seen you before. I'm not... I don't leave home much. Oh. Zeno's daughter. I have to go. Wait. Who taught you to fight like that? No one. <laughs> no one? Well, I I watched you and You learnt all of that from watching me. <laughs> you should become a warrior, you know. Me? I'm dealing. Trials. Come and watch. And bring your sword. You can't put it into words. That moment when you look into the eyes of the one who's supposed to reassure you, make you feel safe. It only takes an instant. Fear swallows you before you have a chance to make sense of it. And darkness becomes a part. But her world changed the day the Northmen took him from her. Senua knows that there's no going back to how things were. That there's nothing to go back to at all. Stay still, stay quiet, hide, don't tell her. Their gods can see into your mind. They will use this power to destroy you. They won't stop me. I can still feel him. Whatever's left of him, they will never let him go. I'm not gonna let him rot here! You're the one rotting here. Leave me alone. You will die here. No! And all your suffering will have been for nothing! Shut up!
I am feeling all the feels right now. You got to experience her little bit of joy there and actually feel happy for once and then immediately turn down to the dark side. In that dark part where the tree was burning and stuff, that was actually the trailer that I had originally loaded up in the first one that kept bugging out because uh, my ISP started being crappy for the first 15 minutes of that one. Super bummer, because that was a great trailer. This is something, right? What is this? That might activate after I talk to him. Okay, there's a couple of them. That's gonna mean something, right? I hope I don't have to touch them because I just got to run back to them again. That's gonna be a bummer. Aha! Can I talk to this one? There we go. Sigmund's sister trades ships with a sorceress, and in disguise. She lies with her own brother. Ew. She gives birth to a son named Sinfjotli. After a time, she sends him to the forest to Sigmund. He tests the boy and finds him strong and fearless. And so they go to take their vengeance on King Sigir. But luck is not on their side. They're captured, and Sigir has them buried alive. Okay, Game of Thrones. I don't want to go up to that tree yet until I find all of these. As Sigmund and Sinfjotli are being buried alive, Sigmund's sister throws an armful of straw into the grave mound. Hidden in the straw is Sigmund's sword, the gift of Odin. They cut their way out of the grave mound and set fire to Sigir's hall. The king burns to death. Sigmund calls to his sister to come out so that she may live and be honored. She does come out, but only to tell him the truth. That she had slept with him, her brother, to beget a strong avenger. I am not fit to live, she says, and walks back into the fire. Strike vengeance from your heart, Senua, as there is always a heavy price to pay. Alright, I hope these aren't just like activating randomly and I'm gonna have to run back and see them all. Cause that's a big bummer if that's the case. These ones look a little different though. They don't look like they have runes. They look like I, I gotta fill them out with runes or something. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. We shall see. Nope. Not going in there yet. Oh, there's just multiple paths up? That's kinda cool. Sword? Is that a sword? It is a sword. I want it. I need it. Lots of gold there. What's up? 
happening? Senu, imagine a sword that can slay gods. <laughs> its name is Gramra. It was forged by the god of all Northmen, Odin, and gifted to Sigmund, a great warrior. I need this sword. It's important. Can you help me? The sword appears whole, but it is an illusion. It shattered into shards long ago. It is said a great warrior can reforge Gramr by answering the trials of Odin, one for each shard. The roots of the Tree of Death will take you to new lands where you will face the trials. Go to the shards. Go to the shards. Go to the shards. What's the shard? All right. Find it. It's the metal runestone. King in the north forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust, and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it. It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn, and it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword Tyrving. Where are we now? Burial mound. It's so strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. Something so very ordinary. Inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death. Because we have no answer for it. But when it comes, forces itself onto our friends or loved ones. Then comes the reckoning. Alright, I need to wait for the screenshots, or the uh, subtitles to go away so I can take a screenshot. I upload all the screenshots I take, by the way, on uh, my Twitter feed if you want to follow me. I, at Vasive underscore plays. All my stuff is available there, as well as any time I go on for a stream, any other announcements I do. So if you want to follow, appreciate it. I kind of wanted to go the other way. Because I feel like this is the way I should be, and I didn't explore down there. And I have a feeling if I complete these trials, I won't have a chance to go back down there. Saving. What was that? Don't go in there. Go in. You talk to Yeah, that, uh... It's too dark. That's dark in there. Can I... Nah. Let's go this way. Looks like my head's on fire. You know what? What are the odds that something's gonna be down there that I need? Like story or something. Can I just look and see? See that beach is awful long. That makes me think something is down there. Ah. Uh. Sorry folks, I gotta do it. Can I put this away so I can run? Oh god. If there's nothing down here. That's gonna be a huge bummer. I wonder if I could go put it out in the water. There's that thing again. What is that actually? 
before though. Alright, what we're doing is we're gonna keep an eye open for faces and talk at rocks. Cause I don't wanna miss things. I don't like missing things in games. Ooh. Nope, invisible wall. Alright, we're good. Ocean sound. That was cool. Yep. Alright. Worth it! Senua, you remind me of a story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. Her name is Herver, the daughter of a berserker born after he was killed. She's a wild, willful child who teaches herself to fight with weapons. When she learns where her father is buried, her only desire is to reclaim the treasure buried with him, but above all, the sword, Tyrving. It's an interesting part of that sword. So, it said. Whenever it's drawn, a man dies, and so does a king. Is that saying that person's king dies, or just some random king dies? And if that's the case, wouldn't you not care? I mean, yeah, you should be like, alright, my sword is for the king, but... I don't know. Could see it being dangerous, though. It's like, oh no, the king died. Now you have this awesome sword, therefore now you are king. It's like, oh snap, I need to bury this sword source so it's never found again. It can never get drawn, so I just kind of go and die. Oh, well, I'm sure Druth will tell us more. It's like a hobbit hole, but not as fancy on the inside. Dark and dank. Isn't that from the Hobbit, the book? Not some dark and dank hole. This was a hobbit hole. In a hobbit hole. Eve's house! Fuck! Who's there? Ho. Oh. Oh. Yep. Oh, that scared me. That scared me good. Oh man. Is this you gonna be I'm a spook? Here. I'm here for the trials. Like when we first met, remember? Can I pick some of this up? Oh man, I'm not ready for spooks. I don't do good with spooks. I don't like spooks. Oh man. Oh man. I'll find him. He's getting further away though. I don't like spooks. Oh, can I light this? Did you hear that? Nothing. Can I light this? Oh. Yes, I know. Have you lost him? You're going the wrong way. Yes, I know. Have you lost him? Have you lost him? Where are you? Turn left. Oh. I wanted to see if there was... Oh. This way. What was that? They say turn left, turn right. I haven't heard that before. Nothing. But, uh, I was going to see if there was more torches in that room. I might have to turn down the sound a little bit, because I'm getting the spookies. Let's give me the heebie-jeebies. Why are you looking that way? Oh, see? See? Oh. Stupid stone scared me. Give me a frighten. Nothing, okay. Ooh, can I like that? That looks like a thing I can like. Like that, Senua. No? Okay. Herver disguises herself as a man to join a band of warriors, and soon becomes their leader. When they come to the island where her father is buried, her men do not want to go ashore. They say that evil haunts the island, and that it is a worse place by day than other places are by night. Fearless, she lands alone. There are many grave mounds, and all of them have ghostly flames burning over them. She comes to the grave mound of her father, 
after passing through these ghostly fires as though they were mist. The flames I passed through were real enough. Damn the Northmen to hell. Uh, I keep seeing things. I don't like it. Uh. Don't touch the walls? Are you kidding me? Yes, it's scary. I don't like it. Why does this game have to have spooks? Oh. Uh. I can hear him. All right. Um. Forewarning to any headphones users, you may have ripped your eardrums at some point in this. So. Forewarning. Oh. I don't feel good. Wait a minute. Is that the way? That's gotta be the way I came from. Okay. Are illusions like locking me in one way? That's interesting. Don't touch the walls because it's gonna give me a spook. Oh god damn it! See? I'm getting turned around because I'm getting spookified. Alright. That's where I came from originally, right? Wait, that's gotta be, because that's lit. Not lit like stupid slang. What the? I don't remember lighting that many. And I can't run. It's just adding to the spook. Don't. Don't. Don't, game. Within the burial mine. Herver calls on her father to wake from death and bring her his sword. She says that it is not seemly for the dead in their grave mounds to bear valuable weapons. Her father answers with words of warning. You go to your doom. Baleful runes surround you. You have gone mad. You have lost your mind. Your thoughts are confused. It is dangerous to wake the dead. Like I said, she reminds me of you. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I guess technically wake the dead. <gasps> That's is that a snake? Looks like a snake. The voice is getting louder. Listen, Dillian. <gasps> listen, listen. That fire reflection scared the crap out of me. Something bad's gonna be there. I don't wanna. Please don't. Please don't. Oh, I'm getting goosebumps. I don't like it. I don't. I don't know which ways to go. Uh, I hear things. Please don't. Please don't. Uh, I'm getting goosebumps. I don't know which way. He sounds louder that way. So what's here? There's another talking stone? Okay, this one's split off. Curious. Is this just a maze that I need to conquer? You don't recognize him. Don't doubt yourself, you'll never find it. She doesn't recognize him. Yes, you do, you know him. She doesn't. Listen for his voice. Listen, Dillian. It's not him. It's not him. We told you. See? It's a trick. It's a trick. I know it. I'm gonna show up. It's gonna be someone mimicking his voice. It's gonna eat me. But I want to find out if there's other stones.
What the? What? That's actually kind of cool. Screenshot. Assuming I can't do anything with this. Nope. If there's anything but there was something behind me, I was gonna scream. I thought that had a cage on it too. Maybe it's just the rocks that made it look like a cage. That voice doesn't sound like Dilly. What's happening? It's not him, it can't be. It's that sound, the voice is changing. See? <laughs> Uh, stop game. Stop. Please. You're freaking me out. Hervor ignores her father's warnings. The grave mound opens, and it seems to be full of fire. Again, Hervor demands her inheritance. But her father warns her that the sword is cursed and would be the bane of her family. But he relents and brings her the sword. She leaves the island with it. The curse holds true, and death would follow in the years to come. And so, Senua, the misdeeds of a father have cursed his daughter. Wait a minute. Wasn't that open? What's in there? What's in there? What is it? A secret room. There are bars. How do you get in there? What was that? How does she get in there? I heard an animal groan. Look it. Someone said, "Don't go in here." So we're gonna cave in this area. Oh, I don't like it. I'm not good at spooks, my friends. I do have a spooky game I want to play on my playlist, though. Uh, Layers of Fear. But oh. I can't do long stints of them, especially when I'm alone. If I'm playing with others, though, I can offload some of my scariness onto the other people's in the the room because I laugh at them more than I get scared. It's kind of a sick humor. Oh, it said focus. There's a clue. Where? Where? You lied. You lie. I just heard it's her. I just went in a circle again. Because this has the two barred areas, right? Yeah. Alright, I feel like there's uh, something that I haven't quite figured out. This whole area yet. Light the torch, light it. It is lit. The torch, light it with you. It will help you see. I already lit it. I'm scared I'm gonna zoom in and something's gonna pop out at me. I'm gonna follow the torches. <laughs> Elsa, <laughs> shut up. Where are we? She has no idea. We're going round and so You have fallen in. You think that sound is Dillian's voice? It's not the same. Okay. It's just a circle. Where? No clue. I see no difference. 
Oh. That one had a... The snake thing on the ground, right? Yes, I need you to help me. She needs us. You're lost forever. What are you gonna do when the torch runs out? You'll wander alone until it gets dark. Wait. Can the torch run out? Because that sucks. There's enough this without to claim you again. Nothing you can do. Nothing. See, I hear things now. What is that? I don't like it. I don't know what's happening. It says there's a clue, but I don't see any clue. There was a snake thing on the ground that one, and I can't find it again. There's no torch in this room. See, it's not telling me about the thing in that room. I don't remember this thing. Okay, that doesn't have the mark. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, look. It gives you a light to make you feel better before it's going to spook me. Do some heavy breathing. Quiet. He wants me to find him. I'm lost without him. Why is the camera getting all drunk? That voice. It's not Dillian. Yeah, I think I figured that out. It's all drunk in here. Oh! I don't like it! I can't... I wish I could run. progress or is this an even bigger loop within the loops sorry I'm being quiet I'm actually kind of freaking out here there was a clue. I don't believe it. Maybe the clue is like... No, that doesn't make sense. Because see, they, if you go through the shield with the same, you go in a loop. Okay, I think I might have figured it out. Nope. 
totally didn't. Go back. I thought this was closed off before. This is new. No, it's not. I'm obviously not picking up on what it's supposed to be making me pick up. So there's clues. Not seeing any clues. Except that the shields change. But that doesn't seem to do anything for me. Whether I follow new ones or not. So let's, let's just actually continue to follow. See? That one is the same shield, so don't follow it, right? But then that leaves the list thing, and I can't do anything here. I'm... I don't know. This one has the double locked door, or locked area. All right, don't know what's happening. I am at an hour and a half of playtime though. So if I don't figure it out here very shortly, I may have to cut it short. So I'm trying to keep these, I would like to get them just be about an hour, but you know, sometimes you get sucked in or it doesn't feel like you accomplished much. So, let's just see if we can get past this never-ending maze of doom. See, it's just... It's just the same thing. It's like the illusion thing that I ran into earlier. But I can't... Alright. I'm gonna go backwards, see what it does. Ah! So when you go backwards, the sword changes. Or the shield changes. Maybe I actually need to find out. Which short or shields you follow? No, you can't because one way always has the same shield, which sends you in circles, and the other way just keeps sending you through more shields. Except for this one. This layout, that's new, that's new. Is this one with the snake on the ground? No. Yep, double red cross, empty. This is going to be the V1 again, right? Red cross, the green thing. Snake. 
at the beginning again? Or did I just mess it up? It taught me nothing. Okay. That's new. Th that's a talking rock. Okay, I must have just missed one. Within the burial mound, Herver calls on her father to wake what? from death and bring her his sword. She <sighs> says that it is not seemly for the dead in their grave mounds to bear valuable weapons. Her father answers with words of warning. You go to your doom. Is this Baleful my runes hint? surround you. You have gone mad. You have lost your mind. Your thoughts are confused. It is dangerous to wake the dead. I think this is my hint. <laughs> so I'm assuming I'm start here. So it's left, right, left, right, 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 left, right, left, right, left, right, 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 right. Okay, let's try that. think <laughs> left <laughs> right from here. This doesn't feel right. We're gonna do five rights. And if it's not right, we're just gonna start from the beginning again. One. Two. This, or is this where I start doing that? I don't know. I'm gonna finish my right things. See what happens. I have three more, right? Come on. One. Oh, I don't like it. See, that doesn't look good. Oh man. What sort of hell beast is in there? This can't be good. Wait. Wants me to face my fears. What? How is that escaping? See the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Boy? Chief, no. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said I could be normal. Normal? Yes. 
No boy is going to save you. No one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you, no. they will turn their back on you. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. No. You will not defy the gods. Oh, screw you, dude. Let's mess him up. Come, child. Take my hand. Hell no. Um, mess him up. Then what? Yeah. I am leaving. You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands. Yeah, leave him. Yeah. Oh, that was it? Man, I was freaking out, thinking someone was gonna come out and eat me. The whole time. Alright, well, I guess... Done. Challenge 1 done? It, no um, I believe that's Challenge 1 done? There's still more. Well, There's you have to be because it let it's me out. But, um... Uh, yeah, I'm really liking this game. Uh, I believe I will end the stream here, though. Uh, thank you for tuning in with me. Um, yeah, sorry, I'm kind of processing everything that just kind of just happened. So her dad seems to be controlling, manipulative, and or maybe abusive. Um, but I guess we're going to find out more about that. And Dillian seems to want to help her be free of not only her father but possibly herself and her own darkness which sounds pretty cool uh, but again yeah I'm, I'm really enjoying this game I hope you guys are enjoying the stream sorry I lost uh, video too I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna name this one but uh I'm gonna try to keep if I get it from twitch are they able to respond and be like yo we actually keep it on the servers I'll definitely get it up on YouTube again um, as I do with the other ones. This one I might name 2.5 or maybe 3 and just do a sad face for 2 or something. Uh, but thank you for watching. Please tune in again. Please like, subscribe, comment if you so desire. Uh, but more importantly, remember to spay new to your pets, adopt, don't shop, donate to a rescue if you can afford it, or open your house up to the possibility of fostering. Uh, that's a very rewarding experience. And again, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope to be able to do uh, uh, meet square monthly here in the next couple months. I have a, a goal, a follower goal set as you can see in the stream. Uh, I need 50 of them and I'm already at eight. So if I can get 42 more, I can actually open up the possibility of having that stream to help rescues, which would be awesome. Uh, anyway, thank you so much for your time and I'll catch y'all later. Bye.